Hey folks, got my work shirt on, I'm out here at the shed, you know, I'm either fixing something or tearing something up. Got some information I wanted to share with you about solar generator charge controllers. Hang on. Orlando Prepper coming at you again. What I did today was change out the charge controller on my portable solar generator. This is the solar generator. Uh, like I said, I built this. I'll put a link below to the video so you can build your own. They're very easy to build, very inexpensive when compared to boxes with comparable energy. I got 420 watts of power here. This is a 12 volt, 35 amp Harbor Freight battery. I have to highly recommend these batteries, guys. I've had this one probably four years and it still holds a charge great and charges up quick when uh, you have it hooked up to a good panel. So uh, that's another thing. Get you a good Harbor Freight 100 watt panel. The ones they have work fantastic. And they charge these boxes up pretty quick. I have no doubt that I'm getting a lot more than 100 amps out of that panel I bought. But I changed out this charge controller. You see right here, I have the Renergy charge controller. This is what I had on there. These you can buy all over Amazon for, you know, eight to 10 to 12 bucks. They're pretty cheap. They work okay. This one was on this box for two years and it worked okay. But uh, when I changed out the charge controller on my emergency power for the house, I went with a Renergy charge controller for that and it worked so great. I said, I'm going to have to try out these small ones. So I got the 10 amp. Uh, Wanderer is the, the name on it. It's a Renergy Wanderer and it charges this box completely off of that 100 watt solar panel in about two and a half hours. With the other charge controller, the little cheaper charge controller, it would take it about five to six hours to charge this same battery. So that Wanderer is the way you want to go. You're going to pay a little more for it. I'm going to put a link to it down below in the description. Uh, right here is a picture. You can take a look at it. Today it's on sale for that price. It normally goes for about 20 bucks. You're going to pay twice as much for this, but the performance is well worth the extra cost. Get that Harbor Freight battery, that Renergy uh, charge controller. Watch my video link below. You can build your own box. I have uh, two 12 volt outputs here, like a cigarette jack and a uh, USB port, plus where the panel goes into the box. Very simple to do. I go, go through it step by step for you. And if your lights ever go out, this is a great little thing to have. All right, then. That's all I got to share with you today. Hopefully you have a great weekend. Uh, you guys got to see the wonderful color that Lady Prepper has added to my workbench with her arts and crafts. So that gives this uh, video a little life, I hope. But the performance on that charge controller was so much better than what I had. I wanted to share that with you guys. If you got a small solar power system like that uh, and you don't have that Renergy uh, charge controller, I got to highly recommend you get it. I'll put that link below so you can go over to Amazon and get you one. Also, remember, I got that link down there for you to watch and you can build your own box just like that. Saves you a lot of money and it works great. So with that, I'm going to say stay strong, keep prepping, and pray for the United States of America. The Orlando Prepper is out.